what up? Welcome back. It's I Destiny. Today I am reviewing the Advanced Snail 96 Mucin Power Essence, and this is by Coast RX or Cosmetic Prescription. Um, uh, for those of you that have been watching my channel, you guys know I love essences. You guys know for a long time I was really, really obsessed with the. Um, I can't even remember its name now. You guys know that I was really obsessed with the Misha Essence. That was like my tried and true. So I just decided to try to switch it up a little bit, kind of give you guys something a little bit different, just because I feel like the Misha one, even though it is a budget essence, um, by all ways of the definition, because uh, the leading essence right now, the SK2 is I think like a hundred and some change. So a hundred and some change down to the Misha, that's like 30 bucks. You know, it's reasonable as far as an essence, but still for some of you guys that are on a budget, I know that it was kind of difficult. So that's why I've been trying to try some new ones. So this one on Amazon is I think around $15 and some change. So the price might fluctuate a dollar or two, you know, throughout the week because you guys know how Amazon be or how the people that be on Amazon be. Um, so I decided to try this one out. I know you guys are thinking like, oh my God, snail, that's crazy. It's not as bad as you think it is. <laughs> so at first I was kind of like, oh, that seems gross. It's going to be slimy. It's going to be weird. Um, but I feel like over the past, I want to say two weeks or so that I've been using it. So if you've been noticing my skin, been wondering what I've been using, um, I've been using this. So, um, I'm going to just kind of break down and give you guys my general review of it. Um, like I said, about $15 or so on Amazon. This is for hundred milliliters or 3.38 ounces. So this is a good size bottle as far as essence. You're not drenching your body in it. It's not like lotion or anything like that. So this is an actual good size. I think um, when I use it in the morning or at nighttime, I use maybe two to three pumps. And the pumps on this are very, very small. So I feel like they did a really, really good job with just the construction of this. Because when you do a pump, like it's not a whole lot on there um, so I feel like it's just enough for your face for some people one pump will do for some people maybe two or three will do I like doing two to three just because um, I'm also doing like a jade roller and gua sha right now um, on my skin so I just need that little extra slip but if you just want to pat something into your skin real quick and head out the door like one pump is totally fine um, so I love that factor you don't waste a lot of product because of the way they kind of constructed the bottle a little bit. Now, does it work? Okay, so I feel like the first day or two that I used it, I really didn't like it. Um, I found that my skin wasn't as um, moist as it was, or I know people hate that word, but I just noticed my skin wasn't as dewy or moisturized um, as it was when I used other products or other um, essences. I, I felt like my skin was more dry, so I felt like I kept having to add more moisturizer or more of like, the, the oils and stuff that I use. But I did notice that after using it for um, a little over a week or so, I would just add a little bit more on there, maybe just like an extra pump. And I noticed that it kind of had this blurring effect on my skin, which I really ended up liking. I ended up getting several compliments because my skin kind of had that very glassy look to it. So if you guys are really into like K-beauty skincare and you really got, love that like shiny, very, very bright glassy look, this is the product to go for. Um, I was seeing a lot of amazing reviews on Amazon of people that had acne that found that this was a great essence for them. So I think that's what it is because my skin is more combination. Um, and I really love my skin looking very, very dewy and very, very, moisturized uh, so for me um, I feel like this is a great um, product for somebody that has acne for somebody that has maybe scarring but for those of you that have dry skin um, this is just I don't think it's gonna do it for you I think you would definitely have to use this um, along with a really heavy moisturizer and serum and 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 so um, but still a good option nonetheless I feel like for 15 bucks it really had a really nice effect on my skin as far as like the blurring my pores looked smaller my face definitely looked bright but I would definitely say this in comparison to the Misha. The Misha is definitely more of like a hydrating essence. It's definitely more of like that formula that I feel like is better for all skin types. And I feel like the second I put that on, I can literally walk out the door if I forget my moisturizer, if I forget a serum, whatever, my skin's good to go and it's a good primer. Whereas this, on the other hand, I feel like you'd have to do this and add your moisturizer, which isn't a bad thing. If you already kind of do that and don't mind adding in that extra step, then it's no biggie. Um, but I feel like over time, like I want to say maybe the past two weeks or so, like two weeks of using it, I did notice an improvement in my skin. I did notice an improvement in my pore size. Um, my pores definitely looked smaller, again, with that amazing kind of blurring effect. My skin looked very, very smooth. The texture of my skin started to kind of smooth out a little bit, which is really, really good. Uh, for those of you that are, are worried more about that, that's kind of like your major issue. Um, so overall, I'd say that this is worth the $15. I'd say it actually gives you a little bit more um, than your money's worth, which is great. And if you're somebody with oily skin 
or um, acne skin and you want that dewy look but you want to help get rid of maybe your scars maybe even out your skin tone and help with acne i feel like this is a great option for you and this is 96 percent snail secretion filtrate mucin um this essence helps the skin to lose less moisture while keeping the skin smooth and beauty healthy so one of the things that i also did with this because again it's not like a super 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 hydrating formula is um, i would spray on a little bit of extra um, rose oil or not rose oil uh, my rose water uh, kind of toner that I use it's not a toner but it's just literally rose water so I would just spritz on um, some extra of that do three pumps of this and just like slather my face and neck in it and then um, adding my moisturizer on after that I noticed that that really helps kind of keep my skin balanced kind of help keep that moisture layer still kind of up so um, it's definitely workable it's not something where you just like okay it either works or it doesn't it's just kind of whatever i feel like you can definitely work this into your routine to have it be something that uh, really works for you with whatever products you have going on but for 15 dollars, it's like i feel like stuff that you find at the drugstore that doesn't really work you pay 15 dollars for so i mean feel free to, to give it a try i like the way it works will i go back and buy this again i feel like if um I'm on, a, I'm on a tight budget and maybe I don't have money to go get my Misha that I will just go ahead and get this. But I kind of love having this kind of in my, my beauty skincare arsenal uh, just when I want a slightly different look. So I wouldn't say it's necessarily on the same level as Misha, but it's like good adjacent. So I'm going to link the info for it below for you guys to check out. And also, I don't know if you guys know this, but I have an Amazon storefront where I have a whole bunch of products kind of in lists that you can look through and see products that I've reviewed, see products that I'm planning on reviewing. I have a whole list just on products that I've kind of searched through and found on Amazon that I'm planning to review on this channel. So you guys feel free to jump on there, uh, see what I have next in the queue as far as reviewing on this channel. You can also see which ones are my favorites, see which ones are my tried and true that I've been using again and again and again, ongoing. Um, but like this video, if you want to see more, I'll be posting more as usual. Make sure to do well and be well, and I'll see you later. Bye.